Alright. Um Yeah, this is another PayPal request from David. More pixies. I do I am loving me some pixies at the minute on the channel. Um Debaser. Pixies Debaser Scotland 2004 Live. Um Yeah, I need to do this quick because I need to have a bath. Because I'm sweating like a pedo in a playground. But yeah, let's go. I know I kind of caught that some of the grunge inf influence they, well, that they actually had on the grunge era, but is it the cure? I'm not really too hot, but I'm sure it's them and Joy Division as well. You can throw into who this band inspired from that. First off, she hasn't changed. She looks exactly the same, but he looks like he should be at, standing at the front on security. He looks like he could handle himself like that. It looks like a problem. But um, again, I think I'm just going to give up trying to get my head around this band. And, and also, Pixies fans themselves have said just, just don't even bother trying to work the band out. Just, yeah, just enjoy the ride. And I really feel like that because it's so hard to pick up on any. It's just you never heard nothing like it. Literally, like, there's little bits that you can go, oh, this is a little bit like that. But like I say, the more that, that you more hear what they inspired as opposed to what inspired them. Because their music's nuts. Like, the structuring of this song is just nuts. I just, I don't know where they got it from. I really don't. Is it me or is that smells like Teen Spirit riff? At least it's the. Kind of same rhythm pattern. Maybe Kurt has just changed like the chords that the first chord is going into. You know what I mean? The, the, the second chord. <laughs>
Yeah, this is a banger. I don't know why I like that so much. Your bones. I don't know why that just it just always makes me smile. That bit. It's so like out of place almost. Do you know what I mean? Like it. I don't know. Like it's, it's just a mad band. I suppose that you could say the biggest influence, at least that I can hear, I can pick out, is punk. 
but there's so much more in punk is like they say with the clash the clash is a punk band but they progress to be so much more like with the reggae and i'm lost in a supermarket there's tracks like that um but this band they have this there's no doubt there's a punk vibe to them that that but then you can say the same with the grunge band like i do say like pearl jam and all them it's punk but it's just not quite punk it's almost got the attitude and the presence of punk but just not quite doesn't check the boxes the punk checks do you know what i mean like there's certain things they do which just makes it different but this band is like punk on acid where you just don't know what it's going to be. Like the screaming and the how he changes his voice is it's just fire. Well, that was two I'd not heard anyway. I know Bow Machine, but that's a fire tune. I like Bow Machine. That was one of the first ones I did, I think. If not the first. She squashes her nose into her bed, and it makes her breathe heavy. I do know that, but yeah, um, that was a fire little set, and tea in the park as well. Jesus, that's old school. Like I remember when that used to be on, and that I don't really do it. Maybe they still do it. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. Um, but yeah, that was a fire little set. Fire. I have to do that last track as well. I'm guessing it didn't finish there. But yeah. That's the reaction. I need a bath. It's hot in England and I'm sweating my gonads off. I already need a bath. I'm starting to stink and you can see my hair is sweaty as anything. Um, but yeah. Sweet. <laughs>